So here we go. This is one more rainy day. Changes, visible changes, sky looking so far on. Looks like the world's been born on one more rainy day. Trying to see the sunlight, my heart crying out loud. I try to see through the clouds on one more rainy day. One more rainy day. Once again, my mind is gray. This is what a rainy day can do. One more rainy day. One more rainy day. Ba 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 ba. Sun start shining on through you. Day day with you. It's strange what sun can do on one more rainy day. One more rainy day. Once again, my mind is gray. This is what a rainy day can do. One more rainy day. One more rainy day. Ba 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 ba. So there we go. Um, that was a little bit more deep purple, just because you know. Machine Heads, your favorite album? I'm kind of with you. It's one of my all-time favorite albums ever. I can even visualize it in my head. I have watched so many documentaries about it. I saw Ian Gillen perform with Rainbow. Okay, this is when I was 16 years old. This is, but hello, Druzy, how are you? Welcome. I'll just explain partly why I love Deep Purple so much, and I have told this story a few times. When I was 16 years old, I went to the Corner Hotel in Melbourne where they were playing, which is one of our big live venues, and Ian Gillen with Rainbow were performing. It was during intermission, and my friend said to me, that Ian Gillen's over by the toilet. So I've raced over there looking at him and I've literally gone bang straight into a wall in front of him. Like literally straight into a wall without missing a breath. He's reached his arm forward, he's put it on my shoulder and he's gone, the toilet's that way, love, and gone back to his conversation. And since that moment, I've loved him even more because I probably would have laughed at myself. I wouldn't have had so much control. So that's my little meeting Ian Gillen moment. <laughs> what a way to do it, hey?